Another solution to reducing our reliance on Portland cement is by using geopolymer cement. So this is a type of cement that serves the exact same function as Portland cement but with a different underlying chemistry. So this is done by mixing certain carbon neutral products like clay, fly ash or boiler slag with an alkali activator. And for this fly ash and slag are some of the most commercially available in the world. So unlike Portland cement that requires the very hot reactions for the Portland cement to be made, this can actually be done at room temperature with minimal emissions. Most emissions, however, come from actually the alkali activator that um, is required for the bonds between some of these raw materials. And some of these raw materials that you might require to make geopolymer cement is first of all, one combination would be fly ash, boiler slag, plus an activator. A second one would be fly ash plus an activator itself. Number three, fly ash glass, waste glass, plus the activator. Number four would be clay, metacaolin, plus an activator. Number five, clay plus red mud, plus an activator. So depending on the country you're in and the availability of raw materials, the composition of geopolym geopolymer cement or geopolymer concrete might be different around the world. But either way, this is a very exciting development um, and could potentially be a huge solution to our emissions problem and an alternative to using traditional Portland cement.